What we're doing is verifying that the screw thread is a quality thread. We check not only the screw thread and its quality, but can even check the nucleus of the thread with this new system. This is something that used to be impossible unless you inserted a tampon inside the thread. Another application advantage that we've come up with is the self-testing capacity of the tester. In other words, if it's damaged or moved, it self-regulates every predetermined number of pieces as we program it. Said another way, if we want the tester to self-test every 50 pieces, it will do so. If we want it at every 300, it will do that too. We can also limit the service life of the testing tool and verify the testing tool whenever we wish. Previously, when a piece arrived to a customer without its thread, or the thread was defective, the piece was rejected, it disappeared, and life would go on. Nowadays, whenever a piece arrives without its thread, all the alarms go on, production chains stop, and a 100% checkup is done to guarantee that the entire product from this point on is an acceptable one. The checkup was just a question of having the personnel working for hours with thread testers, working on each thread. The integration within the production process is very simple. It's an independent system. That is, it has nothing to do with the machine. Integration is very easy. Installing this application in the production process provides us a measure of tranquility. It's very satisfying when a customer who previously had a problem sees the application, congratulates us and says, wow, we want to install this on a large scale. Naturally, this fills us with pride because we've helped to create something that really works. The main advantages that we see for the application are future, guarantee and economy. Future, because customers are demanding it and we have it. Guarantee, because whatever we send out, we send out in top form, it's A-OK. -okay. And economy, because there's no rejection, so naturally we save money. From the 6 million threaded parts that we've checked with this application so far, there's zero PPM. The numbers speak for themselves.